Hi friends, it's Jen and today I'll be making homemade pasta. I've been holding on to this bag of semolina flour for quite a few months and I thought today's a great time to take a stab at making homemade fresh pasta. Okay, so I have one and a half cups of semolina flour, half a teaspoon of salt, two tablespoons of olive oil, two tablespoons of water, and two eggs. Let's get started. So the first thing I'm gonna do is pour in our salt. Now the countertop's already been disinfected and cleaned and dry. So I'm just gonna kinda give it a quick mixeroo here. Okay, so today is just about experiencing new things, trying new recipes, and uh, making pasta is definitely uh, something new for me. And especially with the theme of the novel I'm reading, One Italian Summer, I thought that this would be a great time to try out making homemade pasta. Okay, so we're just gonna... So have, let me know in the comments below as well, if, have you ever made pasta before? I have a feeling that this is gonna be so, 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 so much tastier than the boxed. Okay, so I'm gonna keep Mixing this. Cutting along, it should be nice and pliable. Shouldn't be dry at all. And uh, I think when we're done, after it's rested and we boil it, I think I'm just gonna add a little olive oil butter mixture to it and uh, we'll give it a taste, a simple taste like that. And then maybe the next recipe, we'll do some kind of a fresh chopped tomato, onion, olive oil, dried basil concoction. Okay, friends. I'll be back. I'm going to go ahead and keep kneading it until it's nice and elastic, and we'll be back. Okay, so let's put it in the plastic bag. Okay, we're going to let it sit for 20 minutes. Okay, friends, we're back. Now I'm going to put a little bit of the semolina here. 
And here is our pasta. I'm going to do a portion of it. I'm not going to do the whole thing. I'm just going to do a little blip or so just to, um, just to try it out. And the rest I'll save for another dish. What I'm going to do is just going to cut it in straight lines and just make long noodles. Definitely going to need some more. Okay, so I have water is on the stove with a pinch of salt. I guess we'll just cut it into strips. should be ready in five minutes. Okay friends, let's go ahead and spoon up some pasta. Look at that. Looks good, looks so good. butter and a little bit of olive oil. Give it a quick mix. And let's give it a try. And so here it is. Here is some fresh homemade pasta piping hot with a little bit of butter and some olive oil. And what do you say? We give it a try. Okay, here we go. I'm hoping to see if I can try and make lasagna out of it.
Mmm. Homemade pasta is so much. Of course, there's going to be a big difference when you make it homemade, but compared to the package one, this is a winner, of course. One more bite before we say goodbye. Mmm. I think this is a good, fun way to make pasta. Okay, friends. I thank you so much for watching. And I'll catch you in the next video. Let me know in the comments below. Have you ever made homemade pasta? And if you have, how did you like it compared to the dry? Okay, friends. Thank you for watching. Catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching, friends. Bye.